Hi, I'm Tammy Petoskey with Teen Coach Tammy. I'm a family coach and I work specifically with parents and teens. Okay, now that the kids are back at school, I'd like to share a few tips with you on getting back into the routine of things. It's hard for everyone to get back from that summer mood, but establishing routines, and, and my suggestion is to have a family meeting around establishing routines. Sit down as a family, talk about the, the ground rules that you have, the homework, the chores, the curfews, even your morning and evening routines. Talk about it as a family so that everybody knows what the expectations are. In addition to that, make sure your priorities are clear with your children. It's really important that you set your priorities, what's expected and when. If you expect your kids to come home and get their homework done right away and then take a break, or do they come home, take a break, and then do homework, uh, maybe they start their homework at a certain time. Maybe they have the flexibility to have their homework done by 7 o'clock in the evening and it's up to them to manage that time in between. It's important to make those expectations clear and to set those priorities because if you're, you don't relay that information to your kids, they're going to set their own priorities and those priorities not, may not be in line with what your priorities are. Also the homework environment. It's really important that your kids have somewhere established for homework, a space where they know that they can focus and concentrate. Have the supplies necessary that they need so that they're not wasting time running around the house looking for a ruler or looking for the tape or looking for paper. Have all those materials right there for them. Okay, the next tip I want to share with you is regarding tempers. Now, I know I'm talking about the kids here, but I'm also talking about the parents. As we adjust our schedules and we try to get back into the routine of things, it's very common for tempers to flare. Again, both for kids and for parents. People are frustrated. You need to be out of the house on time. You have to be at different places on time. You're running late. You forgot to do something. The kids forgot one thing or another. It, it happens. It's human nature. We know as a parent when we reach that point where our tempers are starting to flare, it's up to us to be able to catch ourselves. When we feel ourselves get to that point, just stop, pause, take a deep breath, step back. If you feel like you're going to engage in an argument with your teen, just stop right there. And you can even tell your teen, you know what? We're going to stop our conversation right here and we'll talk about this when we're both calm. Because really, whoever wins an argument with a teen, is it worth it? I always say, you know, is what I'm about to say going to push my child further away from me or pull them closer to me? And that's really important that we remember that, especially as tempers flare. And lastly, one of the most important things with your teen is to keep the lines of communication open. It's really important that they know that you're there for them. They really, just like anybody else, they really want to be listened to and heard. For more helpful tips, Join me at TeenCoachTammy.com or find me on Facebook at TeenCoachTammy. Thanks, and I hope to see you soon.